video resolution, just ignore it. I can fix it some other time. <laughs> oh boy. Ow. That's not good. Watch, I'm just there. Nope, not gonna I'm gonna bump my arm on that. Um <laughs> Oh, you such a fool. This was my start from yesterday, which is a stream on Twitch. Wow, that delay. Looking at that delay live is just crazy, you know, guys? seem to be hacking up along. Oh, 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry. I just want to see if I get more viewers here. If I do, then I might switch. I might not. <laughs> um, get everything. I can't tell the difference in that. Where is, where is, there is. I can't, I can't tell the difference. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, Promote whatever. Oh no. get more views but also it's causing me so much more hassle oh
better or should I should I switch? You still there, Strat? You still lay on this, dude. Oh my gosh. Six windows open because I spoon crack for flip and chat as well. There we go, there is I can now see my levels again. Wait an hour for the stream delay because oh my god. Dog decided to come visit, so now we have dog cam is back. Hey, no more dog cam offline. Oh 
Oh, come on, keyboard. That is terrible. Keyboard. Alright, it's been a rocky start, but I'm going to keep going. Oh. monitor on top of the extra fuzz. Um, let's just take a hunk. How much do I need for this? It's supposed to be this size. Hmm. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I think this works perfectly. You know what? Let's... I think that's going to work, but I need to... Um... Prepare first. Oh, come on. Come on does not want to tear. There we go. We have a looser grip. This bit, this section is going to be ears. Come on. They have really long fibers in this stuff. That's not even. That's, that's a little bit close to even. That'll do. Alright, ears are small and maybe difficult, so I'm gonna oh, there's some fuzz in it. What is that? That looks like an eraser shaving. That's nice. That's gonna be quite a large ear. I might actually be able to get both ears out just one of these. I mean it's just no, that ear isn't that large either. Hmm. Which is strict for pretty horsey. And the dragon. Can't forget the dragon. Oh now. How long are these fibers? It's not going to split that way, so we'll try this way. And this seems like a good bit to start with. Ow. Ugh. My lip. Ow. Holding, twisting, and whatnot. I'm not sure how big that's going to turn out, so let's just... Send. What a good dog. Are you a good dog? He knows he's a good dog. He doesn't need me to confirm it for him. 
got so much of this fluff. Let's go for bigger ears. If anything, it'll just make the final thing cuter. That's um, a good start. It needs to go wider. There we go. Far too big for an ear. We'll start pulling it in. Folding and whatnot to make it a proper sized ear. right now. On all right. Oops. Oh boy. I play back, so that's nice. I do wonder if I'm counting multiple times there. Is that shaking? No, that's nice. The camera doesn't pick up the shaking too much. Because I'm bouncing my leg and it's shaking the entire desk. But it, the camera isn't picking it up. Oh, sure it is. Oh boy, that audio really. Oh, I like this song though. Here it's still far too large. Oh, that doesn't help you. Does that help a little bit? Nope. I'm just too pale. Too vampire. I mean, that's that's too much gear. It's kind of cute, but it's too much gear. Okay, we can compress. It's not difficult to make something smaller when you're filming. it off there. I should really not. Yes, I should. That would be cute. Yeah, let's start. Let's compare. No, it's far too large. Even no matter how much I try, that's just too big. The bottom really loosely felt it, so I can spread it out when I get to the Adding it to whatever. Like a deep, 
ridge right here. Hang on, deep ridge. That's not the way English works. That's the proper term for that. I'm poking the center really hard to try and get it to curve out, and it is working. You probably can't see it. But Of material here, so it can be hard to work it into the sort of shapes you want. That's much better here. Yeah, that, that'll come out the proper size. Okay, I'm going to take this pink, which is not fantastic what they gave you because it's they cut the ends, really. That's the biggest problem with this. You never want to cut the end when you're working with felt. So we'll just take the tiniest little pinch of that. Actually, I've probably gotten too much here. Oh, no, it's not the highest quality either. It's um, a little bit rough. Doggo is dogging. I haven't even rolled over or anything entertaining. I'm working tiny, tiny segments here because I don't know how much this pink is going to affect it. Oh, and I want to be careful with my poking because it will go all the way through if I'm not careful. So I'm using the shallowest possible little stabs. This is a good song. How solid is that? That is not solid at all. Fortunately, shallow little stabs don't tend to uh, get comfortable. Top of the ear. Can you guys see that? A lot of fluff coming off the top of the ear, and I don't like how much that is. I wish it were a little bit more consistent. So we're gonna pull that down and try and poke that through. Problem is, anytime your needle goes through, you're pulling a lot of fibers out with it. This is difficult. This is not a good angle. Beginners, don't try this angle. Just leave the thing fluffy. It'll look better than you stabbing your fingers to pieces. Trust me. The top is really dense and then the bottom is really loose, which is to be expected, but we're going to pull the bottom fibers up a bit and more shallow, gentle poking. Hmm. 
dragging it up. SpongeBob, clean up, clean up our SpongeBob. Oh my goodness! Ah, oh, there we go. Now I'm getting movement I want out of that. Now the cup sticking out now. Oh my goodness! There it is. Nope, not quite. A bit of pink is showing through the back, but I don't think anyone's gonna notice that. I'm looking. I don't even know what I'm looking for anymore. Hang on. Where is... That's interesting. See, my analytics say I'm still only got one viewer. But... Oh, and they're gone. Huh. Well, I enjoyed seeing you. Cute ear. Good 
be a bunny ear. It's a little bit on the long side. Ah, that helps. And, oop, set that to the side and make another. Um, I'm gonna start with this wisp. 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 Little wisp. stopping by. That's nice. Multi-tool to really get a solid start. sponge and it's already gone unnecessarily hairy. Come on, fold over. There we go. Be a pretty good place for, I don't know, Santa beard? I don't. <laughs> Think much of it. Good dog. <laughs> oh, poor dog. Oh, stretch. What a cute dog. Trevor, you a cute dog. Good dog. I'm going down and into where I'm Multi tool away. There we go. Oh, that's nice and solid. I heard a sneeze. And I see some adjustment. You think the dog farted? I think it's possible. Proper shape. Whoops, I pulled out a bit of fluff. Go back in there, fluff. I can't hit the fluff. There we go. Dog. Aw, good dog. You cute dog. 
Are you the cutest thing on this stream? No, because this guy exists. Rawr. He'll be finished someday. But he works for the class I'm teaching, and this would be more of a store model. So... Yes, um, the reason I'm making this model is because Ben Franklin, where mom works, has a... Um, well, I'm going to be teaching over there, and they have a policy where if you take a project from them, and you make it as a store model, then they display it on their shelves for a month or two to help drive sales, and then you get your project back, and you don't have to pay for the price of the kits. So I'm doing that. That's why I'm also staying relatively on model. Like, I could give this thing wings. I kind of want to, but I'm not going to. Relatively on model. I've already given it pink ears, which are not in the original, I think. It's hard to tell. I can't see it. It's buried. As much ear as the last one, but it's a little bit thinner. And I have a spare wisp. Let's use this and add some material to it. that that's stupid. I need a different media player for this. I really do. I'll look into one at some point. I also need to look into getting some more songs because I'm getting tired of this playlist. It's got four, five, maybe six soundtracks on it. Let's see. Chrono Trigger, um, no, not Trigger, Cross. Chrono Cross, um, Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, um, Zelda, Wind Waker, and Twilight Princess, and two Pokemon games. Half of two Pokemon games. So let's go with five soundtracks. The bit that I wanted to add is too large. And it's now too dense for me to. trimming this down as well. Ah, and then I can tear that. Cool. Now preserve as much length to your fibers as possible. That will add a lot to this. This will help a lot. Make sure it gets all the corners and blends evenly. There we go. Yep, that's exactly. That feels much better now. Needs some more work in the middle there. Feels a bit loose in the middle. There we go. Now 
big is this? Oh, yeah, I can start shaping properly. And pull up the edges a little bit and start creating that trough in the middle that I used. I add more white. I think I really just need to fold over what I've currently got up here. To there. This just wants to separate into individual strands and not really mesh. Feels like I'm trying to carve against the grain here. where that blue fiber came from though. It's not like it was a default defect in the fabric necessarily. If it's in the fabric, default in the material necessarily. More likely the blue fiber came from this. Wow, that's really blue on camera. It's a little bit more teal in person. But this camera just never wants to show off proper colors. It's either it's old, it's way too saturated towards red. So I just try and make the desk look accurate and then everything else seems to be okay. When the desk and the hands look about right, then everything else, the sponge should be a little bit more saturated. And then things like the blue are way more, oh, there's some yellow on the blue. They're way more blue. This is a little bit more greenish in person. Oh, the other color's fair. yellow. This should be more yellow. How about black? Yeah, of course it gets black correct. Why wouldn't it? Then I've got two more shades of pink, which... This looks about correct. I mean, there's a little bit more difference between this pink and my hands. There should be at least, but... Oh, there's a bit of a defect in it. There's... Almost certainly can't see... Oh, there! You, the camera gets that angle properly. 
you can see the lighter spot in there where the colors weren't blended properly. <clears throat> and then this. Honestly, no, it's almost exactly that for our essence in person. It's really horrible. I love it. I'm gonna use a lot of that. Anyway, back to colors. Um, or not colors. Back to white and boring. <coughs> less pointed than the last one, so I'm just slowly correcting. Oops, I knocked it down. I've got two of these, but they're both the same shade of yellow. Something like, um, uh... Honestly, I might be able to dye this. I should look into that. Just a bunch of this I'll show off when I'm working on better, when I'm working on, you know, light colors like this or something. It shows off this one quite well, but that's a high contrast. The opposite of yellow. Um, blue. And blue or purple. Bluish purple. It's either dark blue. No, wait. Is it dark blue or is it cyan? No, I can't remember. I'm thinking color wheels, and there's two different ones. And I'm thinking. If you're mixing paint, then it be purple is the opposite of yellow. Okay. But if you're using a computer, additive color, I'm trying to remember what's opposite of yellow. Is it purple? Mm, hang on, I'm gonna dry it out. Um, let's actually dry it out so everyone else can see. Can see my thought processes. We'll come back to this selfie in just a moment. trying hard, hard to draw upside down for you guys. Anyway, so when you're working with paint, that is a really lopsided paintbrush. That's 
just a little bit better. Whatever. Paint. Then you have um, red. I should really write this right set up for myself. This because I'm less likely to mess it up. Red, yellow, blue mixed to create um, orange. There we go. Wow, I'm terrible. That's, that's blurry. That's a little bit better. So that's when you're working with paint. But when you're working with light... Okay, shapes. <laughs> uh, when you're working with light, anyway. And then your primary colors are, and again I have to turn it right side up to me. Primary colors are cyan, magenta, green. of yellow. It's blue. Anyway, it's enough color theory for today. Or, and most days, to be fair. Let's go back to actually felting. Where is my project gone? There it is. There we go. <sighs> Was that fun? I don't even know what fun is anymore. I'm far too much of a nerd. my dog wants something. What do you want, dog? Yeah? Are you a good dog? Are you a good dog? Show me. Yeah? Are you showing me something? Show me. Chew. Chew. I think he needs outside. We'll take a quick break and we'll be right back.
And we're back. Oh, Cam is offline. Dog wanted to go sit in the sunlight again. Because he's just such a dog, isn't he? Yes, he is. a little bit further down. Also, it's a little bit loose and it's asymmetrical. And I can kind of pull that to the right place. And if I just... be able to pull this back down and in and whatever. large. And... Yeah, it feels really good. 
again. So this one is a little bit less so all over. Hmm. Something keeps flashing on my screen over here. Dunno. off-colored hair in there. Where'd these go? What color is that? Black? It looks like black. In which case, I'm saying that one came from Trevor the dog. Or from me. I've got... It's not quite black, but it's really dark. up the ear to try and add just move the fibers around that's another off color hair which probably came out of the sponge itself it's so hard to get these sponges clean because as you felt you felt the fur look at look at you see that no you really don't <laughs> oh well it's there and it's everywhere Clean, note to self, clean this after stream. <clears throat> There's a lump right there, so we're just gonna go like that. Yeah, I'm gonna try and take just a wisp of this. It's not gonna happen. Well, it does not want to happen. I just fold it back up. Yeah, that doesn't want to happen. Hmm. Another gosh darn hair. Where did that come from? I'm being perfectionist and I'm overdoing this, aren't I? There's another blue. Blue is really dang obvious when it gets into this, even more so than the black, it seems. Yeah, I can make that work. That's getting pretty close. Oh jeez, my hand's starting to go wobbly. Hmm. I don't think I've eaten enough today. I think that's the problem. I just want to finish these ears and then I'm going to end the stream. But not until I finish the ears. Maybe even... Not even been thought to attach them properly, but... Ears!
not going. And then there's this tail that I think is just too long. I'm going to cut it a little bit extra long. I am going to cut it. I again pull out the fibers that got cut extra short. Just gentle tugging. And it's still just... Man. That'll help. for today. What do you think, guys? Love me. <laughs> well, a review of you... A review of YouTube as a streaming service. I uh, don't think it's going to work for me. Sorry, folks. Um, I think I'm better off just streaming on Twitch and uploading the YouTube videos, up uploading the Twitch stream, re-uploading them to, using YouTube to archive Twitch stream. That's, that's where I'm going with this. Uh, well. Yes. Nice. 